Hey guys, how are we doing? Uh, those were some uh, deadlift, uh, sorry, some uh, squat and bench clips that you just seen there. And I was having some fun today using my new resistance band holders, which I got off Amazon just the other day. Um, they were actually for uh, holding resistance bands under a door for indoor use, but uh, because I don't have any kind of band pegs on my rack, I uh, had to kind of improvise. They were only a couple of pounds each and they seemed to be doing the job okay. Um, definitely worked very, very well on squats. Um, and uh, I did get the maximum out of the bands uh, and then with regards to bench, it wasn't as much out of the bands because of the shorter, because it's so much lower to the ground but um, got to look at a few other things that could maybe help with uh, maybe some longer studs for my rack so that I can try and use the bands also a bit more efficiently on bench and also use them on deadlift as well but I'll need to look more into that to see what I can get uh, so I can start trying to use bands because I do enjoy using the bands. I enjoy the different uh, the feeling that you get as you're kind of pressing up or lifting the weight as such, uh, and it progressively starts to get heavier. It's a bit like using chains, um, so I really do enjoy that. So I'm going to try and implement them a lot more in my training. Um, other than that, I'm going to go into some deadlifts now, just some quick work, uh, and then I've just got some accessories. It's just some volume on bench and. Uh, uh, Swiss bar bench as well, more kind of close grip benching basically, but with a Swiss bar. So that'll pretty much be covering us off for today's video. Um, so next up will be the accessory work. Well that's us guys, workout over, uh, I showed some clips there of the deadlift and the Swiss bar uh, bench press. Uh, I left bench out because everyone's seen what a bench press looks like. Everyone's seen what a deadlift and a Swiss bar bench press look like but I just left them in anyway. Um, right that's us anyway, it's about quarter to one in the morning, we're going to do like 50 minutes of cardio on the bike, dreaded cardio, uh, and then I'll just wrap this up for the day. But it's another end to a week. Feel okay. I was actually just really pleased with that bent, that uh, that squat actually with the bands. About a one fifty or something like that at the top, one fifty odd, which is quite good. We're beltless and all that, so I'm quite pleased with that. Showing me my strength is still there or thereabouts. So the only one thing I would say is that benching with wrap, benching without wraps and bands is a, is not good. Uh, I would always put wraps on if you're using bands because it really does pull you again. It can pull your wrists out of alignment and it can pull them back on themselves so you end up like this when you should be like this and it's not good for the wrist. So if you're going to use bands, I would recommend using wrist wraps. Uh, but that's us. Thanks for stopping by guys. Have a good day. Catch you in the next one.